Hello everyone, I am Axel, as you probably know. Um, today I'm doing a different kind of video. Um, the gameplay that you're seeing right now, that is gameplay from like yesterday. I am not commentating in, um, like during the actual gameplay that being recorded. I'm doing a voiceover instead. Because I, I'm thinking about switching my content to be more like story time in a way, kind of, maybe. I don't really know anymore yet. <laughs> um, it's kind of a, a, a bit of a change. It's like changing the whole entire premise of my channel. Because before it was solely me playing a game and commentating. But commentating is hard. Like, really hard? I I never thought it would be as hard as it was, but it really is. Um. But in this video, I wanted to talk about TikTok. And why it's so dumb. You don't need it. It People say that in mainstream. And yeah, it kind of is. Why the mainstream? Like... 80, 90% of it is just, like, half, like, half naked, no, 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 YouTube, wait, no, ah, <laughs> no, like, half, uh, like, girls with the half clothes, yeah, let's go with that, because YouTube monetization, <laughs> um, but, like, girls with only, like, half of their clothes on, pretty much, on TikTok, doing the stupid, like, renegade and all that. There's, you don't, why are you going on a TikTok for that? There's no reason to go into TikTok for that. Like, TikTok used to be, uh, Musical.ly, I don't even know what Musical.ly was for. Like, I had barely even heard Musical.ly, um, like, before TikTok. Um, TikTok <coughs> is said to be like, or like, similar to the new Vine. Small problem, though. It's not. It's just not. Because in Vine, people actually had creativity. When in most of TikTok, it's just like Charlie D'Amelio everywhere doing the Renegade. <laughs> like, that's all I know. And then obviously, there's TikTok on YouTube, right? <clears throat> and people will record TikTok videos, like screen recorder or something. Um, like, screen recorded a whole bunch of them, and then slap them into YouTube. How many, like, com like TikTok compilations have there been? They were actually pretty good. But how many of them have had the same exact video, like, as another one? <laughs> Almost, like, like, there will be one funny video. <clears throat> And it will be on one compilation. But, you will go to, like, the, um, recommended. Like, on the side. While you're still watching that video. You'll see another compilation for that same TikToker. Okay, you click on it, because that TikToker may be funny. Maybe, ah, maybe funny. Okay. Everything seems fine. Uh, a few minutes later, it's the same super funny TikTok. Okay, it, it showed up twice. Okay, whatever. Click on another compilation, a different one. Completely new one. <clears throat> I've never seen it before. That same super funny TikTok will pop up. It will pop up because there's not that many actual good TikToks. Like, even if it's like a multi creator TikTok. Chances are you were gonna see us like that super funny TikTok because there's not that many super funny TikToks. It's like all just random girls dancing. If you if you want if you want that, then there's like um freaking uh, uh go the OnlyFans. That's the thing. That's the thing. You don't even need OnlyFans, but it's a thing. Like, if anything is, like, more relevant than, like, TikTok, like, or at least it was for a while, I don't even really know anymore. 
To be honest, it probably isn't, but like, whatever. <laughs> like, it's still a thing that people have used instead of TikTok. TikTok should be used for funny content. It should be used for skits. And here's the thing, the only reason why those dancing TikToks blow up is because of the TikTok algorithm. <laughs> because people say that the TikTok algorithm is pretty good. Like, you will grow really fast on it. <clears throat> Here's the problem with that. All of the trash TikToks that just are dancing. Right? All of those TikToks will get recommended. And because they get recommended, people are going to click on those. And then that one um person... Uh, will just end up blowing up because of that algorithm is deciding to do um to like put the all of these dancing TikToks on people's recommended. Or at least I think that's how I don't have TikTok installed, so I can only like assume that has recommended. I don't see why it wouldn't. It's like a social media, so like. But um, believe. That one person will show up in your recommended, you'll click on it, other people will end up seeing it. Like, days later, you'll see that one person grow within, like, two weeks. Like, first day, it'll start out at, like, I don't know, like, maybe a couple hundred. Like, maybe a few weeks after, around a thousand. Uh, maybe a couple more weeks, hundred thousand. Couple more weeks, mm, eh, just, 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 just about five, five hundred, five, five hundred thousand. Because that, because the TikTok algorithm will suggest that one, like, that one TikToker's, like, videos, and just them dancing. But because it's getting recommended to so many people, uh, <clears throat> like, eh, it just doesn't make sense in my opinion. Like, it's good to grow on, obviously. I'm at least, I'll give it that. But if it's not good, like, actually good content that's rewatchable, like, has rewatchability, has creativity, <clears throat> has, like, an actual idea and thought behind it. Instead of just doing some dumb renegade dance. Also, that's like the only dance I really know from TikTok. I know that there's a lot of others because I played Fortnite. Like, Fortnite has added a lot of TikTok dances. <clears throat> but the most memorable one, at least in my opinion, because I don't use TikTok really, is the renegade. Like, that just kind of blew up. All oh, kind of like Hyper Flask, but that's a video for another time. <laughs> um, let's see here. Oh, also, I just want to say, I'm not hating on TikTok. Like, I'm not hating on the dancing, like, community for TikTok. Like, I respect that people want to do it, want to try it, at the very least, are doing what they want. But, in my personal opinion... I don't like it, and I don't really like how TikTok treats certain content. <clears throat> like, for example, YouTube. YouTube doesn't have the best algorithm, right? <clears throat> it, but, it has, like, super small creators like me, who's at, like, 30 subs. <clears throat> it, it's gonna recommend my videos to, to some people, not many, but some. <clears throat> Somebody might click on a video or two. Maybe they'll subscribe if they really want to. <clears throat> Here's the thing, though. It on TikTok, it'll recommend one video. Like it, if you're like super small on TikTok and you make like one video, that one video will go out to way more people than YouTube would ever do for small creators. But, with, like, bigger creators, like, say, um, I want to use PewDiePie because he's kind of, like, off the algorithm now. Um, say, Markiplier. 
Markiplier is getting becoming a little more relevant. Or at least he was relevant. He's dying down a tiny bit, but kind of slowly, I'm pretty sure. Um, like, he's still, he's, like, been at his peak. Like, probably for, like, in, like, 20, maybe, like, 2020? Like, 2020, so like, through, 2020 through, um, 2021, around there, I would say. Is, like, pretty much his peak out of recent. Um, which is definitely really good for him. So, obviously, he's getting, uh, like, a lot of views, a lot of subs because of that. Because the algorithm is loving Markiplier right now. But, here's the, here's the, here's the problem. The way the uh, algorithm works is from consistency, which is good and all, but at the same time, it's by bots. It's by, like, multiple bots. YouTube is a pretty large company. They should have enough people to check at least some videos. I'm not saying that they have to check, like, mine specifically. But they have to check, like, some creator's videos. Like, um, I'm gonna use one of my friends as an example. Uh, Kadix. He doesn't upload much. But if he's actually trying, he's trying to his best to, like, be passionate about YouTube as a whole. Like, as, like, an actual, um, like, job and... <clears throat> And like, uh, like, looking at it as, like, an actual community. Like, I feel like those should be the ones getting recommended. Instead of just having it be as consistent as possible. Because that is why shorts are so popular. Because consistency is key. So shorts are getting uploaded, like, there was, like, um, like, one, like, actually, no, multiple channels. That just had like those dumb posts with like super clickbaity um uh thumbnails, right? And then you would go on to like their actual like page, go to their videos, and you would see they upload like twenty videos a day. That's how consistent shorts will be. That is the problem with YouTube, is that shorts take over a lot of the time. But, at the same time, people don't want to have to do shorts in order to grow and maintain their growth. Because they want to have fun with what they're doing. And they're just rushing through it. Like, you do... And then there's also Twitch. I don't really know their algorithm. It's not the best, in my opinion. Like, from what I know, it's... Eh, it's kind of meh. Uh, so YouTube is probably better, but still YouTube isn't good. TikTok is definitely the best, but for the worst reasons, in my opinion. Um, that kind of wraps up the this rant that was like four, 14 minutes. <clears throat> um, I, I hope you enjoyed. I guess like, subscribe, leave notifications. Comment something if you don't know what to comment, just comment a random number. Cause they just help the terrible, terrible YouTube algorithm to get me recommended to other people. Anyways, have a good day and goodbye.